online and on your smart speaker. Townsville's national award-winning builder, Kia Constructions. Hit News Briefing. Hi, it's Jessica Heatley with your local news briefing. We're already seeing reports of COVID cases emerging in schools across Townsville less than a week into the new year. Chief Health Officer Dr John Gerrard says transmission between kids was high over the holidays and new reports aren't unexpected. Looking at the data of infections in children between the ages of 5 and 17 and there was actually quite substantial transmission. A local woman in her 80s has died with the virus. 46 people are in Townsville HHS Hospital. There are fresh reports that children are allegedly being placed back into care of abusive parents because of an unofficial policy. The bulletin revealed claims from a former child safety officer who details unnecessary reunification. Independent Advocacy North Queensland advocate Matt Clayton says the solution is simple, put kids first. The ultimate goal is to leave the children where they are cared for. This isn't an issue of culture or colour. It is an issue of safety and well-being for the children. Advocates believe a microscope needs to be placed over the entire child safety sector. Thousands of dollars are being thrown in our region in a bid to manage flying fox populations. Close to $61,000 will be spent to move them from the Ingham Botanical Gardens and improve an alternative roosting spot in the Taito wetlands. The Environment Minister says flying foxes play a vital role in our ecosystem and are protected by law. <coughs> And taking a look at local sport, Fire will play the Sydney Flames for a third time this Saturday at the Snake Pit. Townsville's WNBL squad secured a 20-point victory against the Southerners last weekend. American import Monique Billings gathering 25 points in that game. Just trying to set the tone, I think that's going to be a big thing. And really just trying to get my teammates involved. Like, it's not just me. Like, I want my team to, I, we just, we got into a flow and a rhythm. And that's when I'm at my best, that's when we're all at our best. Billy speaking post-game there. And to find out what's happening in Townsville this weekend, favourite the Locals Guide on the Listener app. Introducing the Staria Load, Hyundai's new commercial van that fits in everything. And now it even comes loaded with a bonus for the Sunny and 33 degrees across Townsville today, down to 24 degrees tonight. Tomorrow, partly cloudy and 32. Our listener app is the home of radio, podcasts, music and news. Join up to listen live or on demand now.